people view Salinas. But between San Francisco and Los Angeles, Salinas can st has that potential to stand out between these two cities. Music, dance, theater, arts, and education as well. Sports, academics, the list goes on and on. The potential is going to be because of what I see right now before me. 65% of the population in the city is, youth, is young people. So for me, um, I, see, I see a lot of hope. But before we get there, you got to go through a lot of obstacles. There's a, big, there's a big mountain to climb. And I think you guys know very well what it is. It's what's happened with us not being able to walk from place to place and us not being able to have control. And the solution and the answer there is not in more police. They already have 60 or plus percent of the budget. You want to give them 100% of the budget? You, we can do that. It's still not going to stop. It's going back to the beginning, the root of it. And, that's, and that can be done. But there is no um, strong will or leadership. People are very afraid to speak out here. That goes back to John Steinbeck when he would write these books that are very telling. Matter of fact, got him kicked out and banned out of here because of what he exposed. You remember the industry that did that to him? Nine billion dollar industry? Well, that's the same one that did that to him as well. You start telling the truth, speaking boldly, and start pushing policies to help in the, everything that you asked about, housing, education, business, you become a target. And there's a strong hold here. Um, that has been happening for decades. But now I think that can change with you becoming more involved in voters, registrations, and get the vote out as well. So for me, Salinas is, um, I think, the, f the future. I love it. It's a city I'm born and raised in. And everywhere I go, I share what Salinas is about. Not what uh, newspapers and the media is talking about. Good thing we have social media, because we can change the narrative on that. We can tell what the actual truth is. So to me, Salinas is, um, is the one and only. Uh, clean and fresh air, rich soil. And I call it John Steinbeck country as well. But even before that, uh, I think we need to recognize our ancestors.